All right, guys, this is a video of my uh, lawn care setup. This is my truck. It's a 1994 F-150 XL, single cab. No problem to have a single cab when you only have two or three people working at, a, at any given day. So what I really like about it, though, is this flat bed on the back, step on the side. It's got air suspension as well gas cap built into it. I had to put new leaf springs in after I bought it, but other than that it's held up really well. Step back here if you want to get onto the back. It came with this toolbox. Sometimes I put the gas back there, but on a hot day it's not really a good idea. So I just strap them to the sides here with just some clips and things like that. I use bungees on the side. These are my trimmers. I have a Ryobi trimmer here. This is the one I use more often than not. I like this little piece on the end here because if I'm going next to uh, some vinyl on a shed or a house, I can gauge the distance and make sure I'm not going to uh, damage anything. So I like to use that. This is uh, one that's a little more comfortable to use because it has a strap when you're doing on a, a big commercial lot or something like that. A little more comfortable, have a strap. Your arms and neck don't get tired or anything like that. Pretty good machine, FS55 steel. This is my home light blower, nothing too fancy. I'm not too concerned about having a super nice blower just because it's mostly for cleanup. It doesn't really make the property look uh, any worse for wear it just it does does what it has to do and that's that's it gas cans I usually strap them in here like I said I'll put them in here sometimes but on a hot day it, that turns into a sauna in there it's not too good for the uh, for the cans moving back here my trailer set up I just have a little single axle trailer and this is my John Deere easy track I said 425 not quite a commercial mower but I use it commercially and it does the trick. Never had any trouble with it at all. It's a 48 inch cut. It works wonders, it's fast. I really, really like this machine. I've thought of upgrading and getting something bigger, but commercially it's it's a little on the uh, small end at a 48, but it does the trick and I can also use it res residentially because it's not overly big, but I do still have to bring a little hand mower when I'm doing residential yards, just when the uh, the John Deere's a little a little too big to fit around some certain areas. So this is my lawn boy, Briggs and Stratton, self-propelled, 20-inch deck. Nothing too fancy, but it's a great little mower. Never had any trouble with it. It still runs strong, real fast. It'll it'll pull you around. I also bring sometimes. I have just a regular push mower. And uh, I'm going to do a separate video about that because it's, it's, uh, it's a great little push mower and it, it does the trick when you're, when you're worried about damaging your equipment and, and running it too hard. It's good to have a little, a little push mower that you don't worry about you know, banging up too much. So that's my uh, lawn care setup. Very, very basic, but it does the trick. I can do quite a few residential yards and even all my commercial yards with just the setup right here. Alright, thanks guys. Let me know what you think.